Okay, so now in this example here, we have um, P4. So we have the space P4, and we've got uh, this set, right? Or the, yeah, this set here, the set of these polynomials here. And to get a basis for the span of this set, okay, so that's what we're looking for. Think of these three polynomials as row vectors, right? Because if you think about, you've got the constant term, right? And you've got the, the, the uh, x term, then you've got the x squared term, x cubed, and so on. You can think of these as, quote unquote, the same as row vectors, these row vectors here, right? And hopefully you can see the connection between this and this, this and this, and this and this, right? based on what I just said. And so what we could do is we could use these row vectors in Gauss's method to reduce them. So let's, let's do that. So 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 2, 0, 3, 0, 0, negative 1, 0, negative 3. Okay? So now if I row reduce this, so let's start with negative 2 row 1 plus row 2 and oh just do row 1 plus row 3 okay so obviously these are not going to change so 0 0 1 0 1 and then this one's going to become 0 0 0 0 and negative 2 so negative 2 plus 3 is 1. And then this one here, again, is going to be 0, 0, 0, oh, 0. And then this is going to be negative, what? It's, oh, it's just adding, right? So we're just adding these, blah, blah, blah. This is going to be 4. Right? Um, and of course, because we got a leading one here, this is going to go away, right? Because all we're going to do is multiply by negative 4. So row 2, negative 4 times row 2 plus um, row 3 is just going to make the bottom row zeros. So we're, everything's going to stay the same except the 4 is going to go away. So it's going to be 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Okay, so now we're done. And so now what we can do is we can translate this back to the basis, right? So now we can say that there's a basis for, 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 the, for this set, right? The basis for the span of this set, which is going to be what? Uh, so each one is constant, so it's going to be x squared plus uh, x to the fourth, right? Right? And then the next one is just x to the fourth. And there's our basis. All right, cool. That's it. Have a great day.